A good start from the Devils. Two uh, line rotations now. They've kept the puck in the Panther zone and uh, the forecheck's been good. Shot fired through and a good screen was there, but Vickman just about made the save with the pad. And Andrew Lord will look to make a hit on Brown. Instead, Bentivoglio does that and the Panthers can make some changes, as do the Cardiff Devils. That one gets sent in. Aslin and Haddad are out there with Ulmer. It is Batch on the back end. Fired through. Good save from Vickman there. And it was a bit of a screen too. And we're seeing the, uh, I suppose the big lines go up against each other here. Schultz, Moran and Nicky Forrock out there for the Panthers. Up against the Martin Bentivoglio Lord line. The Panthers do get it in the zone. Bounds will make a save. Here now on the far side is Joey Haddad. Tipped out front. Well saved by Vickman. And again, he's just so calm and composed. And just collected his own rebound with grace. The Panthers will break here. Shooting is Betridge. That's a good save from Bounds. It was a sharp save as well. A fine wrister from Betridge there, who's got a good hustle. That one gets sent on the far side. Here is Nicky Forrock looking to make something happen behind the goal. And then it goes to the point. Fired in there by Dan Spang, but it was blocked well out front. Still with the Panthers, though. Behind the net again. Moran looking to make a play now. Sent in on Bounds! And a fine save from Ben Bounds there. And that shot was released perhaps before anyone was expecting it and Nicky Forrock was right there on the doorstep to bounce, bounce, bounce with a great save. Andrew Lord wins the draw that time and that one will get sent back round and here's Joey Martin looking to make a move but that's a good stick check on the play and away they go and here is Jeff Brown. Big bump on the far side, what a fine collision. Mark Richardson and Jeff Brown as clean as you'll see with those two players there, what a play. Martin makes a nice play to Hoffman away is Bentavoglio up against Stevie Lee. Sean Bentavoglio, but Stevie Lee there with the pace. Still a chance. Hit the post. Andrew Lord jumping into the play. And he looked like a man possessed there, did Andrew Lord coming back into this lineup for the second game after that long break as just on the bench. The crowd feeling there's another chance as it was Bentavoglio off the play from Andrew Hoffman that time. And then Bentavoglio throws a hit. And the fourth line get another go here on this rotation, but it's the Panthers will break away. Going to make something happen is Logan McMillan into the zone, jumping in from deep. Bordelow with a big hit, and the helmet has come off. Logan McMillan there, Bordelow, nobody hits harder in this league, and the Devils come away again. Now Chris Culligan will look to do something. He's got help with Fournier, who has it now. Fournier shoots, and it was sent wide. Good back check play as well from the Panthers on that play. On here, in on goal. Look at that move there, Mark Richardson. He's capable of brilliance. Fired in from Andrew Hotham, and it was parried away by Mika Vickman. A big bump comes in as well. Mark Richardson, he's just such a steady player, but every now and again, he just thinks, why not? And he shows everyone what he can do offensively. Jeff Brown again, over to Rob Lakovitz. He's got a nice outlet there to Jeff Wah. Wah will just make a slap pass, really, and it was almost deflected in on the far side, but didn't find a way through the bounds. It's back there, though, on the point. Sent in again, and the Devils will have a chance to clear the zone, at least. Good work from Bentavoglio. It looks like he's working hard in this first period so far. Seven and a half left there is. Andrew Hotham dips, he gloodling his way through. Then it's a cross-ice play. Martin shoots, but it was well saved. And again, Lindhagen just got right in the lane there, and it made an easy save for Vickman. There now, again, shot. Fired through, deflected, still out front, second up try as Bentavoglio made a nuisance of himself. And the Devils go to work again. Andrew Hotham back to Joey Martin. Now to Andrew Lord, sent through, fine save from Vickman there. And 5.40 left in the first, that's a good play, finding the man down low. Now Lane Ulmer will pick the puck up for the Devils. Skating to the net is Joey Haddad, but Fournier fires and scores! Gleason Fournier sends the Devils 1-0 up. Well, it's given a Gleason Fournier at the moment, but it did feel as though maybe the puck did change direction there. So we'll see if there's a change on that. It's Fournier in the building right now, though. Seventh for the season. Another chance for the Devils. They score! Matthew Myers, the Devils score two in under 30 seconds. They go to work again and kept in well by Bentavoglio. He looks a man possessed tonight to me, John, as well. Again, the big chance there with Martin and Lord on that top line. Now there for the Devils again. Bentavoglio has it. Cross ice. One timer. Well saved by Mika Vickman. Heads up play from Martin. Then makes the pass to Sean Bentavoglio. Those two have been on fire in this one so far. Lindhagen is back though. It's five on five. Inside to Ulmer. Ulmer shoots. It's down there. They score! The Panthers killed off the power play, but in the end, it wasn't enough, and the Devils go 3-0 up.
Panthers have got some big power play guys on the ice. Moran was the one who head manned the puck and sent it over to the far side. Sent in then by Stephen Schultz back to the point. Spang with a bomb there from the blue line, but it went wide of bounds. Now Stevie Lee gets a quick one away and bounds another five save. Over on the far side is Robert Farmer. Walking the line, sends that one down low again. Out front, Schultz fires, but he didn't get a hold of it. In fact, his stick broke and uh, Bounds had an easy save in the end. 53 seconds left on the, on the power play. On the far side they are. Brown has a hold of the puck, goes back to Andy Surtic. Looks for a shot, now finds a lane. Through traffic it is, but that was well played out front by Andrew Hotham. And away goes Matthew Myers. And the Devils will make a quick change there as well, get four fresh bodies on the ice. McGratton looks to finish a hit now, but misses Gleason Fournier. But Fournier got a good pass away as well. And Patrick Aslin headmans the puck. What a play! Shot fired hit! And I'm not sure if Passel had to make a save in the head, but that was the magic hands of Patrick Aslin there opening it up for Lane Alder. Lord will look to put pressure on Spang, but he made a nice play to get away from him and then made a beautiful pass into the neutral zone to Brad Moran. Now Stephen Schultz sends that cross ice to Nicky Forrock, bats it in on Pounds, who fended it away but out of the zone goes Andy Surtich now Matt Carter fires it in but an easy save for Bounds and Andrew Lord with a big bump there sent Jeff Brown flying was it or Luke McMillan my apologies it was indeed McMillan Lord getting in on the on the act now with a hard four check and good play from him Here's Matthew Myers though, in on goal, shot fired in, Culligan it was, just missed, still a chance there to beat Passel, but now Myers gets a hold of it, good stick that was to get that one away from the front of the net, Logan McMillan again, still a chance though for the Devils, out front Morissette, what a play from Lindargan to take the shot away from him though, chasing his Bentavoglio again, but Nicky Forrett will get there first to make a nice play to Moran, who then, well, the outlet was almost there for Lakovic, instead he made the great play to Nicky Forrett, into the corner, back now with Logan McMillan, can't get that through Lord, he gets a second opportunity though, nice pass from him, Dimon then fakes the shot, chance for the Panthers, fine save from Bounds off the bad angle, it's there again though for the Panthers, Dimon working that line so well, now with Logan McMillan, McMillan looks to step inside, shoots well, blocked by Lord, this is the first time really the intensity, of the pressure perhaps has been felt by the Devils in this second period, as Nottingham go to work, over with Jeff Dimon, there for the Panthers again, the Devils managed to change all but one of their penalty killers there as well. One minute left for the Panthers now, Mark Richardson stays on the ice. Lewis is there, fired through, deflected wide, I don't know how in the end, but it did and that's good news for the Devils. Still there though for the Nottingham Panthers, Surtich steps in and that was just way, way wide. Four seconds left for the Panthers. They're in the zone, though, set up and ready to make some count. Lee sends that through. Still a chance. Big save from Ben Bounds, who robbed Dan Spang there with the net gaping. Devils are back to full strength. Sent in, and it's over the top of Bounds. The pressure stays on momentarily, though, and now there's a chance for the Devils to clear. Well, they might be away. Here's Andrew Lord jumping into the players' bed to volume. Lord shoots. Well saved from Yindrick Passel, and we get a whistle with 5.56 left in the second. A play over to Lane Ulmer who's covering on defence and the Panthers can go to work but then he gets turned over, three on two situation, away is Gleason Fournier, Aslin is there but Haddad has the puck, Haddad, trailer is there, fired it, big save, still on the doorstep, Passel, couple of fine saves from him as Fournier made it tick there for the Devils, it stays at 3 nothing with 5.03 left in the second. Jake Morris set with it, 4.56 left in the period. There for Matthew Myers, a battle out front of Passel. The Devils keep it in the zone through Mark Richardson, batted around by Jake Morris set. Jeff Waugh will get out close to Matthew Myers, but still there for the Cardiff Devils. Richardson through traffic, deflected by Myers again, who's a nuisance in front of Passel. The Panthers fans, of course, will know just how effective Matthew Myers is in front of goal. Moran sends it off to... Steven Schultz, Schultz sends that through, deflected out front. It's intelligent play from those two again, but bounds with another good save. Here's Lane Ulmer, sends it over to her dad. Her dad looking to make a play there, up against Stevie Lee. Her dad out of the corner, chance out front, good play from Rob Farmer, took it away from Patrick Aslin there. That was a fine defensive play from him, and well, chance out front again for Aslin, good save from Passel. And, there might have been two or three calls could have been made on either side there, on the, over on the far side of the ice, but 
and Schmeichel keeps the, the whistle in his pocket. Jake Morissette in on goal. Morissette looking to make something and backhand play still out front and it was almost one of those magic goals that Jake Morissette is capable of. Steven Schultz, what a one-two play between those two. Good bit of chemistry for the Panthers on this line with Moran and now Nicky Forrock out front but Bounds is, makes a good save and the Devils get there first again. Still a chance for the Panthers, five seconds left in the period. Can they get one more shot away? McMillan will try, he goes D to D though and Dimon shoots but perhaps McMillan should have taken the shot himself as Dimon ran out of time. But here are the Panthers, Stephen Schultz. We're going to make a move inside. What a move from Schultz. Sends it in and uh, Bounds did enough in the end. It might have deflected on the way through as well, but Schultz just came alive for a moment there. He's such a good skater, Al. He can move bodies uh, uh, just with a little twist of the head, a uh, shake of the head. He, uh, he just uh, fakes people out of the play and makes room for himself. Such a big fan of Stephen Schultz. The Panthers have to keep him in the lineup. Stevie Lee with a nice lead pass to Robert Farmer, sends it in on bounds, easy save for him. The shot count was more even after two, 21-17 in favour of the Devils, so reflects the fact that the Devils were playing more passively, but again, they didn't really give up any grade A chances, perhaps just that one chance uh, that, that was given up uh, on the power play. Might be a one now though, but again, they just read the play well in front of Ben Bounds and keep it away from him. Andrew Hotham uh, in a battle along the boards, wins it and here's Joey Martin. Andrew Lord couldn't take it, and that one will be an icing. It'll come all the way back. Lind Hagen will just tidy things up for the Panthers with just over 14 left in the third. Chance up front, they score! Patrick Asselin of the fine feed down low. The Devils get their fourth. Matthew Myers has a nice easy outlet there for the captain, Jake Morissette. Up against Jeff Waugh. Morissette on the far side with a trailer now. Mark Richardson it is. Cross ice play. Hoffman shoots. How did it miss? Another chance there. And I don't know how the second one missed. If the first one did, the second one was even easier. But Culligan couldn't quite put it away. But a fine build up from the Devils. Another chance out front. And the crowd are enjoying this and they feel this and they go with the Cardiff Devils who've turned it over again might be another opportunity Myers now Hoffman Hoffman with his second chance from a similar position couldn't find the net and away goes Robert Farmer over the far side with McMillan sends it in McGratton to the screen another chance big save from Ben Bounds there McGratton was dangerous out front they've got two big bodies with Farmer there now as well Lindhagen steps in poor pass from him backhand try from Dimon anyway as the Devils scramble good work from the Panthers here as but eventually Haddad will clear and that was nice from them. Seven minutes left then in this one. Patrick Bordlow has it now. Nice move to get around the outside there. The Farmer still with Patrick Bordlow with a good stick. It takes two Panthers to take it away from him and it's back now with Mark Lewis for the Cardiff Devils. Lewis with a nice outlet. Here's Bordlow in on goal. Fires, shoots, big save pass. Another try, Bordlow shoots and scores! Patrick Bordelow stayed with the play and found a way past Passel for the Devils' fifth. Now Jake Morissette to Haddad, well blocked from Nicky Forrock and away goes Stephen Schultz. Nicky Forrock is there, two on one for the Panthers, Richardson is back, Nicky Forrock shoots, big save from Ben Bounds, his best of the night, robs Alex Nicky Forrock and keeps this one at 5-0. Here's Chris Culligan now, looking to do something for the Devils. Culligan, what a fine play, gets bumped off it. Still there for Joey Martin. Nicky Forrock and Culligan come together. And Nicky Forrock there getting in the face of Culligan. Chance in the back door, how didn't it go in? What a fine pass it was. And I think Passel made something of a save, at least there, to keep that one out. Here's Eric Lindhagen, into the zone he goes. He's got a bit of support there, it's Matt Carter who'll look to make a play. Ollie Betteridge is there too. Carter dishes that one, Jeff Waugh steps in, it's well blocked by Andrew Hotham and the Devils will break again you feel, what a nice pass that was, away is Luke Piggott, he, he couldn't handle it, he almost squeezed it through to Patrick Bordelow, you feel was just desperate for Luke Piggott to take that pass from Andrew Hotham and that line will now make a change. Sent in by Surtic, that's good play on the far side from Lakovic. At speed is Schultz, Schultz with a fine move, what a save from Bounds! It was a beautiful play from Schultz there who pulled the move on Bounds, who read it incredibly and seemed to have all the time in the world to get the glove to it. Might be another chance, Schultz shoots again, but Bounds covers that one well. 2.18 left. 
here it is now. Scott Hotham with a nice play. Here's Lane Ulmer. Still for Lane Ulmer. Good diving play from Jeff Brown. Batch now back to Ulmer. Out front it was for Aslin on the one timer. Incredible atmosphere in the sold out Ice Arena Wales as the fans sense a special performance here and feel the team has given them what they needed to believe they can do it this year and win that league title the first in 20 years in the 30th anniversary as the clock runs down a battling defensive performance keeps it away from bounds will record the shutout in on goal was Morissette but it won't matter the Devils win it five to nothing what a superb performance it was from the first period the way they exploded offensively and then in the second and third period the defensive acumen of the side the way they played so intelligently in front of bounds who was fine in net when he was called upon records his first shutout of the season he was superb against the Steelers and almost stole a win for the Devils last week well he gets that win tonight as the Cardiff Devils win 5 0, they stay atop of the Elite League as well. They go on to Fife tomorrow. Huge performance for the Devils in front of a sold out crowd, and just what this building and this franchise needed.